What up, YouTube? This is Getty Radio back at you with another video. I want to give a double salute to all of my supporters and anyone watching this video right now. And if you're new here, please like, comment, subscribe, and join the Getty Gang. Why don't you? Let's get to the content. Okay, Wack 100 speaks on Suge Knight and how he actually got convicted for the 28 years. He says that the man was a little bit reckless in the prison and Wack 100 tried to warn him to not do that. Said Suge Knight did not listen. And he also says, that he has the resources to fight whomever. It doesn't matter. He's never going to back down and he's never going to walk away from any situation. He will keep the same energy. He also says that Suge Knight and Big U may be a little bit jealous of him because of his success. It gets interesting. I'm going to let y'all get to it. Shout out my guy at One Minute Hip Hop. Shout out Wag 100 and the trenches. This is Getty Radio. Let's go. Listen, you go to jail. They not trying to let you talk your way out of jail unless you gonna tell. The only way of talking your way out of jail if you tell. If you ain't doing that, shut the fuck up. Hey, hello? Hey, I'm in Beverly Hills Police Department. Send the bondsman and hang the jack up. That's it. You know that was probably in there scared of she's just talking on Yeah, the because a lot of these is Denzel Washington. They act like they street and all that and ain't got no real training, no A to Z. You know, you got to know what to do in every situation. And they don't know he did what a civilian to do. They're just telling you, him, this call is being recorded. <laughs> yo, telling you. Yo, the, the police, so player nowadays, they literally, uh, they giving phones in there so they can tell them themselves. Like, hey, hey, you know, so they do. They giving their phones that's already tapped. And then when they come in and do the fake search and find the phone, Right? You find out when you go to your hearing, now you got a court hearing because this cell phone was registered to be capped, tapped by a court order, a judge, such and such and such, and we got all these comments. That's what happened to Suge. Suge trial was finna start. News media, everybody there. They said 45 minute recess before this. They press play and let that listen to an hour of his phone conversations and told him we got 300 hours on you. What you want to do? He came, the nigga deal the day he was supposed to start trial at 28. You don't remember yeah. Suge had stipulations where he couldn't get no visits or have no phone calls. You don't remember that? And he thinking yeah, he sir. like calling. He calling like, yeah, yeah, what? I said, bro, what you doing on the jack? Nah, nah, I got the police. I said, bro, they lining you up. Why should you say on this phone? Nah, nah, nah. All right. Oh, you told him that while he was in jail and he was oh, still my mama. I he buried his mama. Why he was in jail, because he was broke. Whack, buried. I sent the wire to the mortuary. And I paid for the food, the banquet hall, the grave, the mother press, the casket. Whack, the truck driver. He talk about, yeah, yeah, he did that. So if the truck driver, you, if you cutting the truck driver's neck that buried your mama, then what we gonna cut, what we gonna say about the music mogul that's broke? I'm confused. You notice he don't never question it, because he know I go pull them wire receipts up. My wife, took instructions from her husband wire it was like 17,000 or something wire this to this mortuary and the notes for this they I, they ain't even had the money for the you know the repast so I had to arrange the mother banquet hall and send the catering all that whack that's why I'm like yo these is all him big you all these is snakes it better be jealousy you reach to it because you need it but the fact that I'm in position to do what I do you hating on them, and then when you see you can't move me your way, but I always stay in position to say double Q anyway. That's what's dangerous about me. I with you because I want to with you, not because I got to with you. And whatever come with, what it, it just come with it. I ain't tripping. But yeah, I buried that mama. You notice he don't not, he, well, I told that like, bro, say one more word, bro, and I'm going to start exposed. Every time I say that about it, they get the away from me, bro. <laughs> Say, say another word, bro, and watch what I do. Because they know. they Look, sometimes they got to be reminded of reality because they lying to themselves. Oh, you got to jar that memory. You shake. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, I ain't. Let me leave this alone because he don't give a See, all that other don't work with me. Hey, we from here away. I don't give a about that. I was doing this when it was dangerous to even be this. I don't give about none of that. When I was 12 years old, restricted to a month ghetto, and, and, and it wouldn't have access to me. I'm 45, filthy rich with a bag and soldiers across the USA from all walks and nature of life, and I'm still grimy. 
I don't give a, that don't work. It didn't work when I didn't have no resources. Damn sure ain't going to work when I do have resources. I'm fighting back regardless. Just right now, I can really fight back in a hundred different ways. It don't matter. Be like, yo, why that? Because I'm not you. You scared. You don't know how to fight. Your resources can be controlled. Could call and turn your water off. Unfortunately, I own my own well. My water is my water. I think it's really just starting to realize, like, ain't changed. He ain't came off the gas, no matter who it is, because it's just going to be what it's going to be. I ain't tripping. Only going to break me is me. And I can't even do that because the accountant's going to freeze my transaction and sign paperwork to where once it get to a certain thing and I get weird, they don't know if I got to be subject to drug testing and all kinds of shit. Anybody, you know, bro, GD, BD, Crip, Blood, Paru, Niz, Home Depot, Lowe's, Police, Fireman. That's just a self-proclaimed title and a uniform. That individual in them uniforms are human beings. They put their clothes on the same way. They eat. They got the same weaknesses, the same vulnerability. That don't mean nothing. Ain't no getting no superpowers putting on a tag or throwing gang sign. Be it no man. It's going to be what it's going to be. One thing they know, ain't going to be a walk in the park. So if you got anything going on in life, you got any ambitions, any movements with your life, it don't pay to come playing with me because I'm going to disrupt, destroy all of that. Or whatever you got going to be, somebody's going on. The most moving they ever had. Whack jumping. That's it. I'm going out of mortar with a bang. You can believe that. You can, you can, you can bet your last dollar on that. Yo, if we do this, he going to do this. No, he ain't. I'm going to try your hand every time. I don't believe. Everybody losing. You, me, them, him, she, this and that. Everybody losing. So the best bet is you stay the way from me and I'm going to stay the way from you. And we can all be happy and get old and just be mad where we mad at. Other than that, I'm telling you right now, I see you, I'm trying your hand off the off the rip. I don't give where you from, what you hollering and screaming. It's busters, cowards, hogs from every set, yours, mine, everywhere. I don't give a about where that's from. 70% of them is from there for protection and they scary. What I look like fear and the scary. I'm part of the 30% that's gonna stand like that regardless. I'm still in the finger banging and I ain't talking about flesh. I hope that can go over your head. Hey, hey, uh, you don't think sometimes they use a temper against you? You don't think they can use like uh, ways against you to try to like set you up? Set what up? Yeah, nephew, I ain't got no habit. I, I promise you, I ain't got no, I ain't gonna never go like, I don't hang out with a bunch of my team, my team, all they, they just waiting on the back signal. I don't, I don't fraternize, I don't gamble, I don't go to the weed spot. Ain't no female gonna tell you I can get him to pull up. If I am coming to see you, don't ask me what time or what date. If you're there, you're there. If you ain't, you ain't. And when you come playing, you will be played with. I ain't never got to go back to the car. I don't give a f If it's in church, I don't get where we at. I don't go outside without no drawers on, bro. We're going to play ball. All right, man. We're going to leave it right there. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this audio, man. Wag 100 just made a revelation. I did not know this. I did not know that Suge Knight had 300-some hours of phone calls while he was in prison, and they played that stuff for him during his trial and he may have been saying some super incriminating things in those phone calls and maybe that evidence was the catalyst for him to look and say man they got me red-handed they got me speaking on certain things i might as well take this time and go ahead and lay it down for the 28 years and whack 100 said he warned him say hey man get off this jack i don't know why people don't understand when you are incarcerated and you're a famous person anytime you're on the phone they're going to be recording you bro so suge knight made a wrong move this was a move a square would have done talking reckless on the phone when you're a public figure who is known to associate with real gangbangers in the los angeles area man this was a rookie move by suge knight if this is in fact true right now let me speak about this right here they used to call wag 100 the truck driver a lot of people say that today he's the truck driver but truck drivers make excellent money and look what happened he had to help suge knight pay for his mother's funeral because maybe the big head gets to you sometime when you on top you don't ever think that you can fall and one thing that's going to always be there if you stay focused on your grind is that legitimate money if you stay yourself out of nonsense beef drama and things that'll put you in prison like should not
Knight did not do. So that speaks volumes right there. Let that be a lesson to the youth. Hey, man, legitimate money is always better than illegal money. A legitimate lifestyle is always better than an illegal lifestyle. Trust and believe. I know, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section, man. This has been Getty Radio. I appreciate you being here. Please like, comment, subscribe. I will catch you guys on the flip side. Peace.